what is the syntax of this okay, okay, function team okay, syntax so you know how this okay, function would be there public interface function two arguments are there one is input another one is output it has a predicate means always only one team because always a okay, predicate of output is boolean now here it is all it is a okay, input apply apply it is called single abstract method single abstract method so here r means where r is equal to where t is equal to input t is equal to input and r is equal to r is equal to r is equal to okay return return any value return any value return any value team so if it is predicate means always one argument predicate means always one argument okay interface interface if it is always okay predicate is t only because method also is called like okay, a test method boolean okay, test method t t because it is always okay written boolean value that's why here always only one argument team very very important team this one if you want strong okay experts on stream api you should be strong on predicate functions consume supplier all these predefined annotations you should be strong team okay now now see here i have your okay, requirement now i am going to my okay, ide i have an okay, requirement team i have a strings okay, list of some fruits are there now i want apply okay i want apply now here see okay i want concatenate team all this list see now here okay, depends see see here i am applying tech okay for dot apply dot sino sino means so what happened it will be concatenation team so now here string string means for what string okay okay i have list of fruits okay string array i want apply a string is called fruit using for each loop you can do okay fund dot apply it will apply for all this okay book it will be okay, applied to all this list of strings team but in real time when i should go for when i should go for predicate and when i should go for functions team see here predicate versus function okay predicate versus function team so okay depends upon the requirement team here if you want if you want to if you want if we want filter the data if you want filter the data based on the condition based on the condition then choose predicate if we want if you want apply apply in some if you want apply some logic to if you want apply some logics okay if you want apply in some logics to no if you want apply some details to all the all the no all the elements no all the okay details to all if you want apply some details to all then choose function okay now so if if you use predicate if you use predicate if you use predicate on n elements on n elements then the result would be result would be either either n or n minus n minus n minus x n minus or okay n or less than n elements less than n elements means 
if you apply filter right okay during means while applying filter while applying filter while applying filter okay filtering the data then okay filtering the i'll while applying the condition while applying the condition data might be filter while applying condition data might be filtered data might be filtered understood team done while applying the condition data might be filtered to team data might be filtered to team okay, next one what is your okay, next one here see if you use call okay okay if you use predicate sorry if you use function if you use function on n elements n elements then then result would be exactly n elements exactly n elements because here here we are not applying any here we are not applying any condition condition and applying okay okay applying changes applying some changes on all the n element all the n element while you are applying your you know, logic you have to think team when you should go for predicate and when you should go for this okay function team very very important team very very important team okay so here 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 we have a test method here we have apply method team it always return a boolean it returns for any kind of okay return type team okay any kind of okay return type now okay next one so predicate having only okay predicate having only so predicate having only one abstract method that abstract method is called that abstract method is called now here test team function will have only one abstract method that is called applied team that is called applied team okay, understood right now here see now you'll write your one simple programs team how to use can we use both predicate function can we use both predicate and function yes answer is yes answer is yes how how use how use cd i have list of okay, employees hope you, okay, you have already okay, employees are there i have list of okay, employee new class predicate function demo predicate function demo okay team let us assume that you have list of okay, employees team already we used to earlier using okay, employees if not there we should create it a okay, employee class yeah we have a okay, employee here employee id employee name okay, employee address if you want we can give employee salary okay. employee salary okay team maybe integer or float or whatever it you can give integer no problem okay team that's fine now see here see team now go to here here we have list of okay, employees team Just try to understand team we are practicing both theory as well as the practical list of okay, employee array list we are providing this list team
list t okay now we will see practically now now we will see practically how it is happening now see now how it is there employee employee is equal to new employee now you would do here employee dot set employee id employee dot set employee name employee dot set employee salary employee dot set address okay. so that's it team now here see how the okay requirement is there i have huge okay, employee object setting employee object to two employee object to three let us assume that alt shift r you can rename this one alt and shift r you can rename this two here you can give any of the your employee here 10000 here some 30,000 or something be. Now I have a employee list. Go to add all this list dot add of employee dot add of employee one dot, dot add of employee two team. Okay. No, okay, that's fine now. See now, all good, all good team now. How to apply this both the predicate? I want to filter data. I want to filter data whose employee salary is greater than 10,000. I want to filter the data whose employee salary is greater than 10,000. First, to what I should do, team, write predicate. Wherever condition is there, wherever condition is there, blindly you should go for predicate predicate is equal to employee salary e dot get salary is greater than or equal to 10,000 I don't want all greater than or equal to or greater than 10,000 okay greater than or equal to 10,000 or okay greater than or equal to or less than or equal to some 20,000. Whoever look okay, at 20,000 of salaries are there or less than 30,000. Whoever is there, I want to add. I want to add some bonus like, you know, 5,000 for all the employees team. Whoever, how to add bonus here. Input is employee. Output also here of employee only. I want to apply bonus. How e colon lambda of expression. How to write this lambda of expression team. How to write this lambda of expression. Please try to understand. E colon. E dot salary. E dot salary is equal to employee dot salary is equal to employee dot salary is equal to there is employee here employee dot salary maybe it's not a stack employee dot salary is equal to e dot get salary plus I want to add 5000 extra team. I want to add 5000 extra. Now, return E. Now, okay, return E team. Return E. Understood employee dot salary is not visible. E dot 
salary is equal to employee dot salary is not visible employee dot salary is not visible because it is available in a separate class right i am assigning some salary is equal to whoever of okay, the salaries are there i want okay I want to increase that salaries. I want to increase that salaries here. I want to increase all the okay, salaries here. How to increase all the okay, salaries here? E dot salary is equal to E dot salary plus E dot get salary. E dot get salary. I want to assign this of everything here. So it should work. Let's see. Employee object. How to become your employee object here? How to give your employee object here? It is important. Team. You have to add to your list here. New employee. One second. Or okay, okay, instead of applying this, can we write this lambda? Instead of apply this, you have a okay, list of okay, employees, right? Okay, you need to apply. Should be something like uh, e dot. One second, go to your employee. Can we make it as we should not give public team? You are trying to access your object to dot. You are trying to access your object to dot property directly. You are not calling the using your uh, static. You are trying to object your property team. If that is the case, it should work. E dot salary. E dot salary. Shall we keep as a static? Let's see. E dot salary. No. You public also. I will okay. I will correct it, team. Give me some time. E dot salary. Okay, that's fine. Now what you are trying to do here? Please try to understand, team. So you okay? You have applied to one is predicate. Another one is you have applied to for. Another one is for. You now here this function team predicate means I have some hundred a hundred employees I don't want to apply logic for all the hundred employees so please some filter the employees based on my business logic once you have filtered the employees you need to implement the your okay future for all the other other employees how to do it this you should do it two things you are declared a predicate and functions how to do it this so you have okay, declared a new 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 okay, employee list new okay, employee list add all this thing all this to new okay, employee list here employee list to no, okay okay iterate all the okay, employees for list 
colon employee employee is to colon employee if if predicate dot test of employee this condition is satisfied then what are the employees are there apply all the employees apply all the employees then you will add this to two dot add of to two of add of employee that's it now see here run as job application so you are not printing anywhere in this list to do right you need to print this list to do here we should print after all would be done system dot out dot print ln employees list r Now run as Java application. CT. How many of employees are there? Salary less than thirty thousand. How many employees are there? Two two employees are there. One is Reno, another one is Mahesh. So I am adding okay extra is called twenty five thousand. I am adding okay okay extra is called here. 5000 means okay 15000 that's it depends upon the requirement you should use okay depends upon the requirement you should use both predicate and you should use both predicate and functions team both predicate and functions team understood right so you have to know okay how okay you okay you have to know when you should go for a predicate and when you should go for function Function is for all the all the elements you want to change. Go for function. Predicate is for only you know to filter the data. How to filter the data based on the condition. Whenever enter asking, I want order details. You know uh, only uh, for order amount. Order price is greater than ten thousand. I want employee details salary. Whenever these kind of questions asking, you should think, okay, wherever condition they are, they are okay, insisting condition, go for predicate, filter. No, no, no condition. I want to apply this logic for all the elements, all the people, go for. I want map. I want to map the, this value to everyone. I want to map this amount to all mapping go for function go for function team all this will be used in stream api team okay next one team so yes yes okay depends upon the requirement yes depends okay depends upon requirements we would use both we would use both okay thing first apply predicate and filter and filter the apply predicate and apply first to use predicate then apply function second one or first to use function then use predicate okay depends upon the requirement team okay depends upon the okay, requirement team okay now another important one what is function chaining chaining means for for, for what now here see chaining means 
combined two or more function into single function is called is called a function chaining combined two or two or more functions into a into a single function is called is called function training same predicate joining combining two three predicates into one single predicate is called predicate joining what are the methods for the in predicate and or negate equal is equal in function also same okay so there are there are there are three methods to perform to perform function training one is there are three methods to perform function training one is compose compose this input is function output also is function next one is and then input also is function output also is function next one is next one is compose okay compose and and then team only two two are there compose and okay and then when you should go for compose and you should go for and then team okay important compose and then okay and then so these two are used these two are these two are default methods or static methods i would say these two are default methods i would say these two are default methods okay if you want to see go to this function it is a predefined okay functional interface if it is a functional interface 100% only on abstract method now here see compose is a default one input is a function output is a function you know and then is it okay default one input is a function and output is a function city understood team very very important team now here too what is third one what is third one see now here see so these two methods are these two methods are default methods and input is function and output also output also function t okay input is function output also function t okay, output also function t understood team now when we should go for when we should go for function and you should go for and then team both are almost to same team both are almost to same okay, examples simple like examples team how to apply this i have a see f1 function one i want chaining i want combining and then function two combined two three two or more functions is called function chain and then means first okay f1 will be applied on your logic followed by f2 first f2 will be applied then okay okay f1 will be applied team compose means okay reverse team reverse f2 will be applied f2 will be applied 
followed by F1 team. What is that meaning? Now we will see practically. Now we will see practically. Now function chaining. Function chaining team. You should give answer. Okay, you should give a answer team. Function. I have two functions here. Always okay, input and okay, output should be there. F1 is equal to yes. S dot S1. Okay, S dot Java dot little dot S dot to uppercase. To uppercase. Another function I am using. Always function means okay, input and output. Put is mandatory. F2 is equal to S dot. S dot. Now here you can give concatenation. You can give uh, okay, substring. Some 0 to 1. 0 to 5 out. Now here see how to do. Now hope you know how to apply okay f1 okay f1 dot apply system dot out dot print ln f1 dot apply if I give three you know system dot out dot print ln okay f2 dot apply three you no know, technologies now I have a function one and function two now I should start this okay, joining team. Okay. Now okay, I should start this okay, joining team. How to start this one? Now system dot out dot see now okay, how to apply out dot print ln see f1 dot interested one see f1 dot apply f2 this written type also is again one function team dot f1 dot f2 it is also one of the written type team or if you want to see function f3 is equal to f1 dot and then f2 and then f2 Got a team now. So whenever you will do this, F1. What is here? And then means you can see F1 will be applied followed by and F2 means first to F2 will be applied. Then F1 will be applied. What is F2 here? 0 to 5 means this one. Techno. On this 0 to 5, first F2 will be applied. Then what you will get? See here, first F2 will be applied. On top of it, then what will be applied? It should give output as F1 team, uppercase team. See, system dot out dot print ln F3 dot apply of apply of now here see. Synotype team. Synotype. Just try to understand team. First you should know what is the value of this one. Then you should know this one team. Now we will see. You want to see this one also? You want to see this one also? See this one on second team. One second team. System dot out dot print ln is okay. Good 
till now dot system dot out dot print ln dot apply both are the same thing dot apply Let's see if I'm providing this. Okay, anyhow, see, it is applied as uppercase. It is applied as. It is applied as. Okay, substring means. Okay, substring means zero to five. Zero to five. Now, what is output here? Here is uppercase. Here is zero to. Five means only four. Four will come. Now let's see. Now run as Java. CT. First upper case means what is output? This is Srinu. Next upper case is what is output? Techno. Means zero to five. No, no. What I am applying? F3 apply Sinotec. Okay. Whenever you will use this, now what happened? You know, first followed by first it will take it will take five. Why F1 will be followed by okay, F2 means first of okay, F2 will be happen. Okay, F2 means zero to 5 0 1 2 3 4 here on this it will apply uppercase what is output here screen 0 to 5 screen that's it if you give okay reverse same example i want to give okay reverse now what is reverse i should give here f4 F1 dot compose F2 will be followed by F1 means F2 will be followed by F1 that means what is the output here see here okay F4 first it will go to okay F1 what is F1 here? Uppercase. All uppercase. Now, okay, output also will be same. Output is same. But when to use what is okay, important? See, output is same. Srinu, Srinu. There is that SOP. Here is SOP, okay. Here is okay, SOP, okay. You can choose here okay four apply you can choose here okay three apply output would be same thing output would be same okay, nothing is okay difference but, but okay, depends upon the okay, requirement it should when to use is okay important sometimes the output would be very determined okay, sometimes the output would be varied team when output would be varied team Okay, I would explain to you. So you should carefully when to use compose and, and when to use then team. When output will be varied team. Now we'll see. Similarly, I have a same functions team. Okay, instead of okay, instead of string, now I have an okay, integers. Integer. I have an integer. F5, F6. F5, F6. Now, go to here. A plus. A colon. Lambda expressions. I plus I. No. Here, F6. I. You should give a star i. Now you should apply your 
your logic team. System dot out dot print ln okay team f1 dot and then and then to to dot apply okay some value is equal to two or whatever it same thing instead of apply here and then here compose team apply and then compose team what is the problem here the string method apply apply in the string method apply input may be anything output may be like anything We have to use yep five or six. Sorry. Yep five. Yep 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 yeah yeah. Sorry. Five. Six. Five f sixteen. Okay, team. Now let's see. Here output will not be same because the calculation would be different, and then means. First apply this multiply, then apply this sum. Compose means first apply in sum, then apply the multiply it. Depends upon the requirement. See, you should go for and then and compose team. And then and compose team. Okay, understood team. Now, next one. A functional interface will have. Okay, okay next one team. A functional a function interface we have one abstract method one am and comma two default methods and one static method and one static method and you should go for static method now we'll see that static method is called identity 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 means whatever of input will be give same as output is called a yeah? identity public interface function we have already okay, discussed about apply apply is the abstract method another one is called another one is called compose another one is called it is a default methods. Some body is there for this default methods. Another one is another one is identity. 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 Identity is a static one. Another one also is there and then. As you know here, here input may be anything output may be anything as you know here here input will be compose input will be function output also is the function and then input is the function output also would be the function static identity means whatever you will give here same as the output here. See, whatever you will give here, same as the output here. Static identity. Input. So, returns the function that always returns the okay, input argument. Whatever input it will give, that's why it is a same. T is the input, T also would be output. T type of the input and output objects here, T. Return type always return its an okay, input arguments. And you should go for this team. Okay, that simple okay, example team. Okay, a simple example. Once we'll done this okay, simple one. Now we'll stop. Now here see function 
string string f is equal to function dot identity identity t. now system dot out dot print ln e f7 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 dot apply of Cnotech. Whenever you will give Cnotech output also always it will be same output team identity. It depends upon the requirement you should go for this system. This is called okay, functional interface team. Okay, functional um, predefined okay, fun functional interface is called function team. Tomorrow we will see how to okay here is only for a input team okay input is only one if two inputs are there we should go for by function how the functional interface wrapper classes are there into function double function how it works and all to improve your application performance how it works we will see tomorrow team